Hello. Oh. Hey guys, as many of you may know, today is Earth Day, and you know what that means. Time to go running naked through the rain. What rain? Rain and celebrate the moon goddess. Is that how you celebrate naked in the rain? Today is the day that I share with you guys some of my favorite things about Earth and some of my not so favorite things about Earth. Favorite thing number one, Earth is a place where my dog lives and I love my dog. <laughs> Look at her, she's so cute and great. Thing number two, Earth is a place where my friends live. Literally every single person I know in my entire life lives on the planet Earth, including you. And favorite thing number three, all food. I love food so much. And all food that we eat comes from the planet Earth. Some of my favorite foods include avocados, almonds, artichokes, I mean food that begins with the letter A, it seems like. But that's not the only thing all three of those foods have in common. They're also all foods from the state of California. Wow! In fact, the state of California is responsible for producing the vast majority of America's fruits and vegetables. Like, really a stupid amount. 97% of walnuts? That's crazy. I just thought walnuts came from the sky. But here's a bummer fact. California is in a super, super severe drought. On January 3rd, the state of California conducted its first snow survey of the wet season. And we had, oh, you know, 20% of the average amount of snowfall. That's not good, you guys. Don't believe me? Check out these pictures of Yosemite's Half Dome. 2011, 2012, 2013, 2014, 2015, oh my god. This is a real drought that's real and oof, it sucks. Now I know what you're thinking, Hannah, when's this gonna get positive and you're gonna tell me something happy I can do about it? Well, I don't know, you know? Cause it's like, what are you gonna do? Eat less nuts? Maybe, that's a start. California's responsible for 45% of the nation's nut consumption. And we're not just talking about WeHo in San Francisco. Ah! So a lot of the water usage in California doesn't even come from residences. It comes from like hotels and farmers. So it's not just California's issue, this drought, just as any other state's issue isn't just that state's issue. It's the nation's issue. We all have to act like we're one big thing to affect change in any part. That being said, you guys know my personal philosophy is always better to do something than do nothing. So there's lots of water saving tips online. I've included some links below. If you live in California or frankly any state and wanna be more water efficient in your home, go for it. Great idea. But let's go back to talking about the whole of planet Earth, shall we? Not only is it Earth Day, but we're about to enter into another political campaign season of people talking about things and throwing out the word climate change to get you to want to vote for them or not talking about climate change to get you to want to vote for them. None of that really matters. What matters is educating yourself and empowering yourself to do something about it, right? Okay, good. So let me finish this with this. Climate change is real. It doesn't fucking matter if you believe it or not, it's real. So have a lot of great day. But you guys remember a while back when everybody was talking about divestment and how universities were divesting from carbon burning companies because those companies are accelerating climate change, which is the reality that we all just have to accept. So what if everybody who wasn't like a government player and who wasn't just, you know, making money off a giant corporation, what if all the other people like celebrities and musicians and like private individuals like us, what if we all divested? What if we went to the people who have like your retirement plans and all that stuff and you said, I want whatever money market you're using my money in to be totally, totally green. Just make it green. Oh, but you're gonna get like a 9% return instead of a 13% return and then are you really thinking about your future? And that's when you say this. You say, yes, I am really thinking about the future. Are you thinking about the future or are you thinking about the short term, which is money? That's not the green we should be concerned with. Anyway guys, these are the thoughts I'm having this Earth Day. Uh, I really, really, really love the planet and the people in it, and I want it to last as long as possible. Our beautiful planet or the monies. Anyway, have a great day. Mwah. While you can, sorry. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel for new videos every Tuesday and Thursday. And if you're new to the channel, please watch a bunch of videos and see if you like it here. We're a really cool, fun time.